YouTube. Based on a true story. Both. If it is, that's cool. My name is Lucas Myrtle. This story happened when I had just started my first year of college. I was 18 at the time and had just moved into an apartment with my friend. And I needed to find a job to pay the bills. After searching a bit online, I found a job that seemed perfect to me. It was a job as a security guard at a local arcade. I'm sorry guys if I sound congested or if I sound like a prepubescent 13 year old. I can't control it. <laughs> I'm trying to breathe and talk at the same time. I accepted the job without hesitation because I always loved games and the job paid very well for its appar apparent simplicity and straightforwardness. Well, those are some big words for a Reddit post. After chatting a bit with the manager on the phone, we manually agreed that I would start later in that week. Dot dot dot. Ooh. What is this? What are the Okay, let me let me get comfy. We're getting comfy, yo. Spooktober has officially started. I know uh, it's the 12th of October, but <laughs> it is what it is. All right, what am I doing? All right, am I going to talk to this guy? Dude, this is totally like Fierce to Fathom. They kind of just knocked it off a bit. Wait, do I press E? Uh. Excuse me. I am a burper, so you will hear me burp. I don't mean to. I apologize. I apologize in advance. That was good food, huh? I'm stuffed. All right. Okay. Yeah, no kidding, but man, I still can't believe I couldn't get uh, Stephanie's number. She's always hanging out with her boyfriend anyway. Well, then <laughs> why are you trying to get her number? I mean, just saying, I guess. Maybe that's a sign, dude. Better luck next time. Yeah, man. Nah, I just need the right moment. She'll come up. Oh my God, bro. She's got a boyfriend. Back off. Bruh. Bruh. <laughs> come on, my homie guy. Uh, speaking of luck, I finally found a job. It's at the place called Hillside Arcade. No way, dude. That's awesome. Working there sounds like a dream, man. Free games and everything, right? I hope so. Mm. Alright, so what are- Oh. Excuse me, fellas. Mind if I say something? Oh, sure? I'd recommend you check your shoes before you leave. Not everyone gets lucky in here. Whoa. What do you mean? Is something weird going on? Who knows? Could just be an... Wait, could, could be a untied lace. But it never hurts... But it never hurts to be careful. What the... What was that? Was he joking or... I don't know. But that's definitely the weirdest thing I've heard all day. Anyway, let's find out. Let's get out of here. I've got a new job and I don't want to be late on my first day. Let's go. Vamonos, muchachos. Yeah, this is totally fierce to horror, uh, fierce to fathom horror esque, is what it is, and I love these type of games. I just wish they come out more often. But Rail Studios, they make they make good. I'd rather them taking their time. One day later, nine thirty p.m. Holy shit, man, that is late. And I I miss arcade games. I'm not gonna lie. I grew up in. I was born in nineteen ninety four, and. Man, arcade games were the shit. I know I, it wasn't the height of the arcade. I guess they started weaning off like in the early 2000s, but I enjoyed them for the little time that we had them. Ooh, I like this. Look at this. I like how it looks. It's very... Uh, I wouldn't say interactive, but it, it looks it looks lively at least. It looks normal, you know. Man, it's taking a little bit. Please don't hit me. Please Oh my god, he almost hit me. Holy shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, that's good shit. I can do this. I can breathe. It's starting to clear up now though. As I Hey, what's up? Welcome back. <gasps> Thank you for tuning in. I'm live streaming a little early, as you can see, but Saturday's a wild card, but I appreciate you popping in. How you doing? We're just doing Spooktober. I'm going to be playing a lot of horror games. This Well, I'm on this channel mostly going to be playing horror games, but it's a specialty this month, I guess. Oh my God, did that guy just shove me? Son of a bitch. <gasps> All right, let's sit our ass down. Oh, we got to press E. Okay. But welcome to the live stream. I'm glad you could tune in. Okay, so what do I do? Oh, I gotta talk with this guy. 
Jesus Christ. Has the bus been running late a lot lately? Yeah, sometimes it's like that around here. I hate waiting this late. You've been around here long? Why are you- <laughs> You could say that. I work nearby, take this bus almost every night. Oh, so you must know this place pretty well then. Yeah, you learn when to be concerned and when not to be. Oh, what did Poppy say? Oh, hi, Poppy. First day, you excited? Not really. Well, at least you're being honest. I guess. Anyway, make sure you don't do something stupid and always listen to your manager. Yeah, I know. Good. Also, don't forget, I'm gonna pick you up on the 24th. I can just taste mom's famous apple pie. Oh man, this is an old ass. <laughs> That's an old ass phone, my guy. But yeah, this is totally fierce to fathom. It's totally a knockoff, but I'm okay with it. I've been... I played all of them so far. And I've been craving more of these type of games. So this is perfect. 9.57 p.m. I never play horror games. I just watch people playing them. Understandable. I was the same way <laughs> when I couldn't, uh, when I didn't have a, like, a way to play video games before. I watched PewDiePie, Jack, Mark, so it's always fun. I won't be able to play every horror game because I'm a chicken shit, especially, like, the ghost ones. Those freak me out. But it's always fun watching someone else play a game. But it's weird because I don't do that too much anymore. Now that I'm doing content, I don't watch too much anymore. It depends. Oh, oh, wait. Are you coming or not? I am coming. Nah, let me get on the bus. Holy shit. <laughs> I don't want to miss my bus. Imagine there's an achievement for missing the bus. Alright, let's get in. <laughs> Yeah, there's just certain games that I won't play myself, but I will watch someone else play, for sure. Some survival games, too. Well, hello? What do I do? Oh. Where are you headed? Uh, Hillside Arcade. That'll be two dollars. Ugh, I don't have any cash. Do you have a credit card? Yeah. Well, you're in luck. There's an ATM at that gas station down the street. I'll hang tight here while you get the money. No problem. Uh, usually they don't do this. I don't know how I forgot the money in the apartment. They... Oh, okay. Oh, I guess I'll just take a seat. I thought he was gonna have me go get the cash real quick and come back. Because, yeah, that's unusual. Oh, even the startup car sound is from... <laughs> oh. Alright, let's see. Where are we going? Oh my god. I'm trying to breathe, help me! You know, I gotta say I like this though. Oh, where are the cars? Well, I mean, it is in the middle of the night, but... There's gotta be some activity. And why did I sit right in front of this guy? There's a whole fucking bus that I could have sat down. Any seat. And I sit right in front of the guy. The creepy guy. Come on. Where are you going? Just a place in the city. Is that somewhere new? Not exactly. Why do you ask? I love discovering new places. Sometimes I discover incredible things. This can be fun. You think you will find something exciting at your destination? I hope so. See, this is why you do not sit. There's a whole fucking bus. It's so awkward to sit next to someone, a stranger, <laughs> when you've got so many options for seats. Okay, there we go. Now it's looking more lively. I like this. There we go. I like it. Me liking. Me liking this so far, I have to say. That was kind of a long... <laughs> kind of a long transition. 10.36pm. Ooh, whoa, where the hell am I? How far the hell out am I? What am, what am I going to Iron Bark? <laughs> the, I think that's the third Fierce of Fathom game, but like, holy shit. Oh, is this like a trailer park? Gas? How far am I going? We have arrived at the gas station. Now you have the opportunity to withdraw money from the ATM. Okay, I'll be quick. Yo. Well, I I thought I'd be like in the area. It's it looks like I've been like 
Where the, how far is my fucking job? I'm in the middle of Timbuktu. <laughs> okay. Alright, where's my objective? I think it's over here. Alright, let's walk a little faster. Okay, here's the ATM. Oh. Uh, withdrawal. Uh, I guess we'll do 10 bucks. Okay. Ooh, I'm rolling in it. Hell yeah. And then I think that's it. Cool. And then... Um, how do we get out of here? Oh. There we go. Okay, I just had to click the money. The money, yay. <laughs> okay. Uh, do I need to talk to this guy? I don't know. I'm gonna... Well, he said it's gonna be real quick. Uh, maybe I will need to talk to this guy. Let's see. Still looking for an ATM? No, just look at you. Uh, no, just look at you. Is there a problem? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Yo. Okay, so basically, um, the main story is I am Jack Myrtle. I got a job at a local arcade. It's what it's saying, but I'm driving in the middle of buttfuck nowhere. And, um, this will be my first shift. I'm just taking the bus right now since I don't have normal means of transportation. Oh, I guess I gotta go around. And I'm taking a bus to my work. And then I'm gonna do my first shift at the arcade. So that's all it is. This is... Games like this are like, a. Uh, they're based off of true reddit stories is what they say. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. <laughs> are you headed somewhere specific? You scared me, my guy. <laughs> my apologies, I tend to appear unexpected. So that's, that's the premise of the game. And then we're just following the story that's usually posted on reddit. And... Just experience the life of what this person went through in real life, in their eyes. <laughs> Fucking hell, are you headed somewhere specific? Yeah, I'm getting back on the bus, I've got a destination to reach. The bus isn't always what it seems. Are you sure you know where your journey will end? Yeah, it's just a trip to my stop, why do you ask? Because some journeys take you to places you never expected. Be careful, the road ahead might be more mysterious than you think. What do you mean? Who are you? Enjoy your ride. God damn. You jumped too? Okay. Okay. Was it just me? Okay. I'm, I'm not the only. I'm not the only one. <laughs> Holy shit. That was just unexpected. But that's that's kind of what it does. That's what these series do. They, they get you all of a sudden. Here you go. Here's the money. Uh, great. Thanks. Now we can get going. Sorry for the delay. Had to grab some cash. No worries. Uh, things like that happen all the time. Suit yourself. It won't take long to get to your stop. Thanks for being patient. Yeah, but you're saying it won't take long, but I don't know my guy. I am I am really far from the city. What, does it take me an hour to get, you know, to my job? At this point, I'd rather just buy a beat-up car and drive there myself. 11.09pm. See, it's been like... Two hours. How long does it take for me to get to my damn job? Is it like in the next town? Oh, this looks cool though. Oh, wow. Yeah, this looks- what is this, in New York? It looks like New York. The stereotypical New York, of course. Oh, we getting off? Alright, let's- let's get up. Ooh, this guy! How did he get here? It's the guy that creeped the fuck out of me, what the fuck? Hey, don't sit next to me! Hey, yo! Oh my god, he sat next to me! I hope to arrive! I hope you do too! There's a whole bunch of fucking seats! Why are you sitting next to me? Piece of crock of shit! <laughs> yeah, you would. 11.29pm. <laughs> uh, Fuck! Ugh. Oh man, it's too early for this shit. I just woke up, man. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Why did this guy sit next to me, you fucking creep? <laughs> there it is, Hillside Arcade. Alright, my guy, I'm gonna need you to scoot the fuck over. Here we are, Hillside Arcade. Alright. Hey, can you move? I need to get out. This isn't your stop. What? 
Yeah, it is my stop. You damn creep. My god. I hope he's not coming with me. Yo, can you help me? You're like, you seem normal now. This guy's a little creepy. Uh, see you later, bus driver. Thank you for all you do. Uh, it's- it's gonna be nine now. Um, uh, I woke up like three hours ago. Finally, I have arrived. But I was trying to, you know, like, not sober up. I don't know how a better way to put it, but I was just trying to clear my allergies and stuff because I woke up pretty, like, sickly. So I waited a little bit before I could stream. Oh god. Well, where the hell can I get in? Hello? There we go. But yeah, it's- it's pretty early for me. I want to start earlier. It's too dark in here. Yeah, it is! What? I thought this was place supposed to be open. I will turn on my phone flash. <laughs> Your phone flash? Okay. Oh god, why- I thought it would be bustling already. Why are we here so late? Oh my god. Alright, where am I going? Alright, here's the counter, but I think I need to find my boss. That's what I need to do. Oh, where are the lights? When the lights go down in the city. Employees only, okay. Let's go this way. <laughs> sports, oh my god, they're actual like sports games, it's funny. Alright. <laughs> Fucking shit. I, I did see him, but then the music <laughs> and him coming so quick. Fucking hell, mate. <laughs> You're late. Yeah, fuck you too. Uh, sorry, I had... Uh, don't make excuses. You're late. End of story. There's a beginner's manual on the computer. If you have any questions, just look through it and it will be probab- And it will probably answer it. What if it doesn't? It will. <laughs> Oh, that's right, I'm a security guard. Okay, I'm a security guard in an arcade, so think of, like, Five Nights at Freddy's kind of deal. Okay, I imagine I don't sit here. I probably sit here. Or I'm watching the cameras. Watching the cameras. Alright. So, why does he need this place monitor? I mean, you've got cameras, my guy. You don't, you don't need this monitor 24-7. I don't think your business is that profitable. All right, but I don't know what to do, though. Uh, I guess I sit here. Uh, beginner's manual. Hello, if you're reading this, it means you're a new staff member at the Hillside Arcade. We welcome you with open arms as we enter this new chapter with you. Before we get you to work, there are certain things you must know to give our customers the best arcade experience. Below is a table of contents, with said pages giving a rundown of each position we have here at Hillside Arcade. Okay. What's this? Okay. No, 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 no. Below is a ta- Oh! Do I- Do I- How do I- Oh. Oh! Chefs, cashiers, janitors, security guards. Okay. Working as a security guard is one of the most important jobs here at the Hillside Arcade. We trusted you, out of many others, to protect our beloved establishment. We are sure that you will do a great job. But before starting, there are a few things you must know. Watch cameras at all times. The most important job here at the arcade is to watch the cameras. Protecting the perimeter of the area, making sure nothing happens. Make sure to write down the daily reports. The second most important job here is writing your daily reports. Writing down everything that happens throughout the day helps us figure out how to make the arcade more safe for our customers and workers. Protect yourself and the business. If you ever get in a situation with a business or you are at risk, make sure to call 911. Okay. That's cool. Camera. Oh. Cool. Alright, let me see if I can get out of this. Do I just... Okay, what do I do? Escape. E. Do I have to click each one? Oh! Interesting! This is kind of like Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> okay. I hope this isn't like a ghost thing. Oh, god. Okay. I heard like a... Like a sound effect. <laughs> a creepy one. I guess I just sit here and, and look at the c cameras. 
Whoa, whoa, is he falling asleep? Yo, wake up, wake up. No, <laughs> you're not supposed to fall asleep on the job, you idiot. 1.57 a.m. Oh, you're such an idiot. Uh-oh. What happened? That's, that's, that maybe it's our pop-up. Oh, no. Uh, let's get that. Hello? Yo, what? Stephanie gave me her number. Doesn't she have a boyfriend? She broke up with him a few days ago. Dog, it's just a number. You're just a hater. <laughs> oh, God, wake up, dude. Uh, get up. Okay, space to get up. Or, okay, what do I do now? I don't know. Um, I'm a, I'm a little weirded out. Okay, I didn't have to do anything. 2.27 a.m. All right, well, let's keep looking. Oh, it's a point door. Mm, it's a little ajar. I'm just here doing my rounds, just kind of looking at the camera. Doing my job, doing a good job. Uh, I don't know about that, though. The door looks a little open there. Might want to investigate that. Check it out. I'm just going to sit my fat ass down on this chair. I'm a good security guard. I don't know if I'm supposed to see some- Okay, I'm scared to drink. I don't want to choke while I look at something scary. <laughs> oh, something's about to happen. I got it. Oh, I, 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 Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Get. Yo. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, yo. Ay, yo. Come on. Let's call the police. Let's call the police. Holy shit. All right, call the police, call the police, call the police. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> what was I supposed to do? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh god, what do I do? Cuz they're coming at the door. I guess I confront them, maybe? I don't know. Let's try that. <laughs> Let's just go outside. Let's go out and say hi. <laughs> oh, come on, my guy. Okay, let's call the police. Or can I, can I hide under the table? Uh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Let's go. Wait, what? Oh, did I lock it? I think I locked it. I think I did. Let me in! Let me in! I have to call the police now. Open the door! Let me in! Okay. Alright. Alright, let me call the police. Okay, that's what I had to do. Alright, let's call the police. Let's call the popo. -po. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, popo. -po. I locked the door. 911, what's your emergency? There's a crazy lunatic breaking down my door. Stay calm. Okay, good. Now, do you know where you are located? I'm at the Hillside Arcade. Okay, the police are coming, son. Just stay on the phone with me, okay? Okay. Oh. Uh, okay, I need to, like, hide right here or something. Oh, Lord. Come on, come on, come on. If this is all there is to the game, I don't know. This... <laughs> I'm gonna be disappointed. Oh god, are they still gonna be pounding? Yeah, they're still pounding. Let me look at the security cameras. Okay, I don't- I don't know if I see someone. Oi! Oh! What do I do? <laughs> what the fuck? I was on the phone with police. <laughs> I guess they eventually broke in. Oh! They were supposed to break in. Oh! Oh shit! 
I guess that's why he's talking about this was in my final journey. <laughs> I don't. This is just weird. Look, it's a it's a two dollar game. Okay, we can't judge it too harshly. <laughs> what the fuck? If this actually happened to someone, <gasps> I made it. I don't know. This was this was kind of creepy. They tried to do the fierce to fathom. Uh, <sighs> I, it was okay. It was okay. It wasn't bad. After the police came and arrested the two men, they were felons who had just gotten out of jail. The whole situation did a good number to me. I started going to therapy, and my therapist recommended me to tell people about my story. <laughs> this isn't fucking real. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, no hate on the guy, okay? I know he's trying to do the what Rail Studios is, but it definitely needs some work. <laughs> Ugh. Only Rail can do it the best, but hey, you know what? Oh well, it is what it is. All right, can I get out of here? 